Hi there, this is Al from the East Bay Slot Car Club. We're located in San Leandro, California, and we would love to see you here racing on our beautiful track. So today we're going to talk a little bit about our power distribution system. Now, obviously the power comes from a 110 volt outlet on the, on the house, runs through an extension cord down to a uh, surge, surge strip down here, and the transformer, which is a 110 volt to 18 volt 10 amp transformer. This came off of eBay. It's only about $25. And it is actually this little pot right here, the little yellow pot. It's actually adjustable plus or minus about two volts. So you can get your track to run at exactly 18 volts if you choose. So the 110 volt power, 120 volt power AC comes in gets uh, electric magical changed over to 18 volt DC out and we always run a 7.5 amp fuse and that protects the control unit and that gives us more than enough amps to run we've had we've had I think four cars plus two ghost cars in the past so so the 18 volt goes out and comes in here goes into the goes into the power supply slot on the control unit and the control unit does its digital business and sends the voltage and the digital encoding to the track so there's there's pairs of pairs of circuits so we have over here this is a this is a Carrera standard jumper cable so we have the jumper cable wired into the provided slots in the back of the track. So the jumper cable provides the power. And you can see here that this goes into a series of four jumper blocks. Each jumper block is one wire from the track. So the jumper blocks, the jumper blocks look like this when they come out of the package. It's basically a bunch of screws and then the key the key for our uses are these are these uh, electrical jumpers and these make all of the screws have the same uh, continuity so the jumper block has one color of wire each each jumper block only has one color of wire this is the red jumper block this is the black jumper block and this one is the white jumper block so each one of the jumper cables goes to a different location around the track. And basically what we do is we just drill a hole in our track, in our plywood, and the jumper cable comes up and supplies power to the track. And it works really good. We have, I believe this year is a 180 foot track and we need those jumpers. So uh, track runs really nice and smooth. So anyway, this has been this has been Al from the East Bay Slot Car Club in San Leandro. I hope you come and bring a car, bring a career or digital car, and uh, come race with us. We race on Sundays. All right, so if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to comment below. All right, thank you. I look forward to hearing from you.